What's up guys, it is Silixir back at it with another video on the group own channel and in this video guys I will be telling you guys how you can get your first 1000 views on YouTube Growing on YouTube is something that is very competitive nowadays and since there are many youtubers uploading at the same time It will take some work to get your videos out there But before we get into the video make sure that you subscribe to my channel and like this video if you want good luck for the next 10 years but anyways guys, without wasting any more time, let's get into what you need to do to actually get more watch time, more views, and actually get monetized on YouTube. The first step that you would actually want to do to actually get views on your video is clickbait. So basically, when I mean clickbait, I don't mean like straight up like putting inappropriate content on your thumbnail. What I mean by clickbait is like make like overhype your thumbnail a little bit. When I mean overhype, make it to where like something that you would just want to click. Even if it's the most boringest video on earth, if you have a good thumbnail and title, you will get views. You want to make the thumbnails like something you would just want to click. When you make your thumbnail, do not go too overboard and do not actually put random stuff that will get your video taken down or a lot of hate. That just don't do that because that will not be good for you or anybody else in the long run as that could get your channel taken down for terms of service violations. The second thing I would recommend to actually get your first 1000 views is make your video over 10 minutes. This is very important because if your video is long and over 10 minutes, it will give you a better chance of your video actually ranking on somebody else's recommended page. You want to make your video over 10 minutes just because again youtube likes videos over 10 minutes and the longer it is the better that means that you have a higher chance of actually getting again on somebody else's page which is really the whole plan because that's how you're going to get your first 1000 10,000, 1 million views on your youtube channel another thing i would recommend is to not buy views on your youtube channel I used to think that before buying views to help your videos rank and a bunch of people think buying views will help your video get out there. I will tell you guys right now, buying views will destroy your video. YouTube, they can detect if a channel buys views or not and they will just keep the video there and let it be there. Buying views will not get your channel anywhere and it will most likely get it banned. Buying views again will not help your channel rank, you'll just look like an idiot. So make sure that you actually get organic viewers that can actually get you monetized and all of that make sure that real people are watching your video do not do any sub botting sub for sub view for view do not do any of that because that will not help your channel rank at all the only thing that would give you is a lot of inactives that will not do anything for you another thing that will help you get your first 1000 views is that if you actually have a big social media presence outside of youtube if you have a twitter account instagram account vine or any one of that what you want to do is you always want to hype up your videos. You want to, like, if you have a big audience, make sure to hype them up so they're ready. Like, they're going to stalk around your Twitter. They're going to be ready to click on your video. Keemstar, if you guys don't know who Keemstar is, he is a good example of that. He has a Twitter with over 2 million, I believe. And every time he posts his videos on his Twitter, it skyrockets in views, which is really good for him. So that's why... You really need to have a big social media presence outside of YouTube because you will always have fans there that are ready for anything that you put out there because, again, YouTube is not all that cool for associating with your fans. Another thing with social media is that make sure you actually talk to your fans on there because if you actually have fans that like, like you and you actually respond to them, they will have more motivation to actually be like you and actually listen to you and all that. I really just like to say, if you have made it this far into the video, I am really, th I really thank you that you actually watched it all the way through to here. That really does help me out and it helps you out too. So if you're still here, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and like this video if you would like more content to help you grow your YouTube channel. But anyways, without wasting any more time again, let's finish out the rest of this video and let's get this out for all of us. Let's go guys. Another tip to actually gain more subs and viewers on YouTube is again, make sure that you are using your own content. If you do not use your own content, there will be a good chance that the bot that actually runs YouTube will strike your video, claim your video, or completely blacklist it. Meaning that if you search up for that video, it will not show up. It will be shadowed. 
So basically, you want to upload your own content because so the YouTube bot does not take you down. Make sure to also try to not put any copyrighted content in your videos so that you'll have a higher chance of actually ranking. Because if you do put copyrighted material, there's a chance that you can't get blacklisted. So again, guys, you want to basically do stuff that's your own. You do not want to copy people's videos or re-upload them straight up because, again, it will completely flop and, you know, it would just be a waste of time. So make sure you actually upload your own content. Oh yes, we come to the one that mainly hurts the small YouTubers. Edit your videos. Do not upload your first try. If you do not edit your videos, they the people who will click on it will just click off immediately. Make sure that you actually edit your videos. Anytime you mess up on your video, make sure you edit that out if you do not want it. Do not start over or else you will be recording forever. Please make sure that you actually edit your videos because we do not want to see a uh, nine hour footage of you trying to record a video. Please edit it. I see this all the time. Just please edit your video. That will, ha that will make YouTube a much better place for everybody if you just please edit your video. If you guys do need good editing software, if you are a beginner, I would recommend Filmora 9. If you are a more advanced and know what you're doing person, I would recommend any Adobe products. Like I would recommend Premiere Pro or Sony Vegas. Sony Vegas can is also pretty easy to use, but if you like something basic, please use Filmora 9 on your computer. If you don't have a computer, you can use iMovie. But what I'd recommend doing is if you use iMovie, use another program for your iPhone or Android. Because iMovie will just make you look like um, a zero sub YouTuber. So make sure you actually edit your videos in a good program that will make your videos look epic. Another thing I would recommend is to use spam tags and tags. Spam tags are, again, if you, don't know what, if you do not know what spam tags are, it is in my description. It's basically a bunch of tags that are just there to help your video rank. If you use spam tags, you have a pretty good chance of actually ranking and getting views. If you do not use spam tags, it's optional. You don't have to use spam tags, but it's just a little boost. But putting normal tags on your videos, if you don't know how to use normal tags, if you upload a video on mobile, usually it should be, well, like if you publish it, usually it, there should be a tag section where you can copy and paste your tags. And on PC, when you upload it, it should give you an option to put tags too. If you do need tags, you can use rapidtags.io to you to basically get spam tags and normal tags these tags will basically give you the best tags for your channel and i would recommend it for everybody who would want tags to be put on their video another thing that would help you get viewers to your channel is live streaming live streaming is very essential to the growth of your channel because live streaming can basically get all your fans and put them together in one stream to where you can communicate with them and answer their questions Live streaming, again, your live streams can easily get pushed to new audiences so that people would actually click on your live stream and, yeah, sub and all that. If you would like to live stream, make sure your live stream does look professional and, some, and something that your viewers want to stay on. Try to crack a lot of jokes in your live stream. Try to be really active with your chat so that your chat knows you're just there because you actually love them. Make sure that, again, you actually do all of that on your live stream if you would actually like to rank. Doing that will, again, give, give you a higher chance of ranking because it will give you actives on your YouTube channel. Actives will basically help you get your first 1,000 views. And if you keep on building up actives, you will have a very successful YouTube channel. One quick little thing I would recommend for you to actually get viewers on your channel is have good channel art and icon and banner and all of that. If your channel art is good, you will have a higher chance of actually attracting people to your channel. If your channel art is really bad, like if your icon is like the picture of your like computer, you have a really small chance of actually getting people to click on your video. Because you're going to think you're some random who doesn't know what they're doing. Make sure that you have art on your channel so it looks like you know what you're doing and that you actually invest your time into your channel. But anyways, guys, that has been the full video. If you did not like this video, you can feel free to dislike it and tell me why you did not like it. And I will try to make it better for everybody next time. If, but if you did like the video, feel free to like the video because that really helps me and you out. And it'll give me motivation to actually upload more to you guys. If you guys would like to talk to me, just feel free to comment. I will respond as fast as I can because I have nothing to do on my free time. And yeah. So again... 
you're at the end of the video and i would recommend that again you try to follow these steps a couple times so you can actually get used to what you're doing but again guys thank you for watching my video if you we'll like again oh my god um I'm I'm not going to cut out the bloopers this time because it's the end of the video and does not matter. But again, if you would like to like and subscribe, please feel free to do so. But again, it's been Selix, you guys, on the group-owned channel. Group-owned. And um, again, well, feel free to see you guys next time. So, um, yeah. Have a nice day. Peace out.